Thought we got a good scrimmage. Um, thought there was some physical play at times. Uh, the ones look much sharper than the rest of the, uh, the rest of the units. So we're still working to develop depth and uh, continue to improve and uh, our fundamentals in all aspects of it. I think they just uh, they, they play faster. They uh, communicate better. They um, they uh, execute more. You know. And sometimes you know the twos. It's, it may just be one person that doesn't execute, but that you know messes the whole deal up. So if you can get 11 guys doing it right, then uh, you got a chance to be successful. But where are you with Ryan Flanagan and where he needs to be and where you need him to be? You know, Ryan has uh, progressed very fast. Ryan is, uh, pick, you know, he's a junior college player, like I said before. So they pick it up quicker. They've been there before, and um, I'm pleased with his progress in only one week of where he's at. Concentrate on throwing the ball more and. Uh, we threw the ball, I, I don't know, maybe two-thirds of the plays in the scrimmage. Maybe that might be a slight exaggeration, but we threw the ball a lot. Want to see where we are with the quarterbacks. Um, Want to see where we are as far as the receivers getting open. And we did some good things. We got some growth to make in that area for sure. Um, and I think that's going to be a big part of us, improving on third downs, being able to protect, throw, and catch. So so those are some of the things we worked on. They're good. Mikkel, I thought Mikel really had one of his best days, you know, through the spring and this fall camp. He's a big kid, and he ran like a big kid today. We did some short yardage situation, and I thought he got behind his pads and really ran solid. Um, but I was pleased with him. I just walked back from the stadium with him, and that's what I was telling him. I thought that was probably as good as I've seen him run the ball since he's been here at UK. Um, I thought Dorian Baker. Dorian Baker made a couple plays downfield on some deep balls. I thought Rashad Cunningham made some made some plays on some deep balls. Um, uh, Cameron Fogel made a couple of really nice catches today. We got the ball to Timmons down the field. You know, I expect him to make plays. Those, those are some of the guys that, that stood out. You know, we're better than we were a year ago. We, we're still, you know, Kyle Meadows is, is still competing for that third tackle. Uh, Josh Crock, Tevin Eatman, you know, um, I think Kyle Meadows, I've, I've, been, I've been pleasantly surprised. Kyle Meadows is further along than maybe I thought he was. Made a huge jump since the spring. Um, Interior-wise, Nick Haynes and, and Cole Moser have come on. You know, Zach Myers is a lot better football player than he was at any point last year. So, you know, I feel better about it. You know, are we there yet? No, we're not. We're not. We need some more bodies. Um, but I am pleased with those with those guys that, that I think we're counting on to be back. Is there, what's nagging you right now? Where, what's an area that you say, oh, we got to get better in this in this next couple of weeks? Well, our passing game. Yeah, our passing game. We've, we've got to – and a lot of that has to do with where we're splitting reps at quarterback. And, and we've had – some wide receivers that y'all know about, Javis Blue, and some of those guys that, that haven't practiced. Um, so that's our first order of business to get healthy. You know, that's, that's what I told our guys when we got together after the scrimmage. We, we've got to get healthy. That's our first order of business and practice with everybody that we're going to play with. Um, and once we do that, we'll really concentrate hard probably for the next five or seven days on the passing game.